All right, guys, so I got something cool to show you. Uh, this company called Swordman sent me one of their lawn mowers. It's a real mower or a cylinder mower, and it's pretty cool. It also has some attachments, and uh, yeah, so I'm going to be using it a lot this season. This video is more an introductory uh, video to show you guys some of the cool features of it. Um, I'm going to do a full review after I've used it quite a bit. So um, I've used it a tiny bit so far. Um, there's there's pros and cons to it. I think, um, you know, it's not going to be for everybody, but there is definitely a crowd that's going to love this mower. So I'm excited to uh, show it to you. Uh, let's go find it. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh boy, look at this. There it is. Now, all right, where do I even begin? So right now, the attachment that's on it, this is a grass catcher, is uh, basically a thatching rake. I was raking up in the backyard with it. But this will pop out and you can replace it. Here's a broom. Here's the real mower, or the real. And uh, yeah, it's really cool. So. Normally when you have a lawnmower with a reel, you got to send in the entire machine to go get it serviced. But with this, you can pop this out, mail it in. They have mail-in reel sharpening services now. Um, you just send it in and you're good to go. Um, what's cool too is on the side, it's really easy to adjust the height. This is just magnets. So when you pop these guys off, you just Unscrew a bolt on each side, pull the pulley, and you're good to go. Um, you can switch it out, I don't know, less than a minute. And I love that this is magnetic. Um, I'm even doing it one-handed. Uh, the mower, the engine is very quiet. I've actually been surprised at how quiet it is. And it makes sense because this is just spinning this. It doesn't need the oomph of a, a blade flying around to cut. So it doesn't need as much uh, power, but uh, yeah. These are the handles. One will uh, drive it and one will turn. This turns the reel. It's got the lock. Um, the throttle. They got a little pouch here that keeps the tools that you need to service this, which is a great idea because how many times do you go, oh, where's the tool for that? Um, yeah, and you'll notice it is a full roller on the back, so this thing's gonna stripe great. Now, let me go back here. The, the con, for some people, is the max height is two inches, but the Super Pro is you can go down, this is one fourth of an inch, and you can go down even smaller than that. So you can do very, very low cuts with this. Um, you can see it's made in the Czech Republic. Um, yeah, this is, this is going to be pretty cool. I played with it. I'm going to mow the front yard at two inches for a little while. Um, and then the backyard I'm going to do nice and low. Um, here's another accessory. You can get the front roller grooved, which I hear gives a better, deeper cut. Um, the one that's on it right now is just a flat roller. Oh, I got it dirty. Um. Yeah, let's put the grass catcher on. All right, I'm trying to do this one-handed. There you go. Um, yeah, it is, it's a really cool mower. So that's gonna be the, the fun new thing this year. Um, they sent it to me completely free of charge. They said, hey, try this out, show in the videos. Now the story is uh, they're new to the US market this year and they want people to see their awesome product. Um, they're doing it in Europe. So I said, yeah, I love helping uh, businesses grow. Um, you've seen the Pro Plugger, a couple other different things I've showed off. I love showing off unique, cool stuff that uh, you know, it hasn't really made its rounds yet, and we're gonna give it a good testing. I'm gonna play with it a lot. Especially that. You can use that for uh, 
brushing in after leveling. Um, so that's what you got to look forward to. Of course, the front yard, I'm going to do more of a traditional cut. The backyard, I'm going to go for awesome low cut, um, like the English garden look. And I'm really excited about that because I've I have wanted to do that for a long time, but I didn't have the equipment because with a rotary mower, you just can't cut that low. It just, and I tried doing that Scott's manual reel mower, but that thing's a pain. Um, this, you, you want the reel powered because that gives a better cut. So anyways, um, if you have any questions about this mower, feel free to post them. And then in future videos, I'll make sure I answer those questions so that way we get a good quality video. <laughs> now I'm done, my hands are freezing. It's still too cold to do anything. <sighs> All right, I appreciate you guys watching my videos. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up, uh, subscribe, comment, all that fun stuff. It's what makes this uh, really enjoyable and fun making all these videos. And uh, be sure to check out the ones below. Have a great day. Bye.